Oh! What is that smell? Right. Smell it, right. honestly. No, take that away. That is disgusting. What it's do you think like it is? Somebody's been sick on it. Oh! My hair. Uh. Uh. What is that? Get into the zone, get into the zone. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name's Yolanda Melody. Today I'm really excited because I actually ordered something. Today's haul is gonna be misguided. And if you've been watching this channel for a while, you will know that I have said quite a few things about misguided. I've not been the nicest to them. And today I really, really want to try and like them again. I did a little bit of a comparison between Boohoo and Pretty Little Thing. I was on a little bit of a shopping rampage. I'm not gonna lie. I spent hours scouring each of the apps and I came to the conclusion that Misguided's prices are really, really good, like really cheap. So for that reason alone, <laughs> I really want to try and start liking them. Don't be fooled by the size of the package, guys. It's what's inside that counts. What's happening to the lighting? We appear to be having some very big lighting issues right now. Really sorry. But yeah, anyway, I've got loads of items to get through. There's a lot of tops and as you can see, the tops that I wear don't really use up much fabric. So anyway, here we have item number one, which incidentally isn't a top. Let's open number one and let's try it on. The lighting is really annoying me right now. Okay, that's even worse. <clears throat> <clears throat> okay, so I like it. <laughs> yeah. So I've been wanting a skirt like this for a long, 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 long time. I really wanted the perfect camel skirt that's ribbed. I want it tight around the waist, loose around the booty. This is ticking all those boxes. It's pretty thick. It kind of feels like you could wear this in the winter. You could also wear it in the evening if you live in the UK in the summer because it never really gets that hot here, unfortunately. One thing I'm a little bit funny about, hold on, is it does do some weird kind of ruffling going over here, like rickling. If you can see in the reflection, it's creating not a very nice silhouette in the reflection. <laughs> it's kind of making me look like I've got lumps and bumps that aren't actually there. And even when, oh God, yeah. Okay, this is me tensing. Like I'm literally tensing for dear life right now. It's just really not complimenting me from the side. From the front, it looks great, but from the side, not so much. The waistband is super duper tight. I cannot get over that reflection. What the hell? Ew. There we go. This is why I grow my hair long. <laughs> Okay, so I would wear Spanx with this. I don't know whether that would make it better, maybe. But even if you do wear the Spanx, you still might get a bit of a strange silhouette in the reflection. Also, if you're moving around and stuff, if you're dancing, hold on. It's just, it ripples. <laughs> anyway, that being said, I do actually think I'm gonna keep this. Hold on, a cup of tea. So ironically, I'm most likely gonna wear this if I'm going for a meal, because after I've eaten, there's no two ways about it. I'm gonna be bloated. So whenever I go for a meal, I always wear like a specific bag or I have a scarf or something to just cover up the food, baby. And in general, the material feels very good quality. It's very soft. It doesn't feel like it's gonna start falling apart <laughs> at the seams. So yeah, I think, I think I'm gonna keep it. Oh, and also I didn't forget <laughs> the booty test. That's insane. The ruckling. <laughs> okay guys, time for the next item. I have a feeling that this is not gonna cover my bra. I mean, this top that I'm wearing right now is very, very thin, but this one seems even worse. There's only one way to find out. <laughs> I 
You know what, guys? I think I'm gonna send the skirt back. Yeah, and the top. <laughs> right. Oh. <laughs> I don't understand. How are you supposed to wear this? Oh, for God's sake. I hate this. And I'm gonna send this back as well. Um, I don't know who or how or when <laughs> you're supposed to wear this because you can't wear it with a bra. It's incredibly difficult to make sure that all aspects of your bra are hidden, including the straps. I haven't even shown you the back yet, guys, right? It might look like your bra's covered up. <laughs> You've either got the choice of showing the bottom or showing the top. And I don't think either is a good look, to be quite honest. <laughs> right. What was I saying? I wanna get this top away from my armpits because there's no way I'm keeping this and I'm sweating. If you have um, big boobies <laughs> and you're going to like an X-rated party or something, then you could just wear this without the bra and it would show cleavage and under boob. <laughs> I don't think that this is aimed for the average person, so it's trash. <laughs> Next item. I'm gonna change the camera angle, this is really annoying me. Okay, so to everybody else, this might look like a dead bird that's just on my boobs. <laughs> Listen, I love this. I actually love this. <laughs> it's such a vibe. I honestly think this is one of those items that actually looks better in real life as opposed to on the camera. I don't know why. When I look in the mirror, this looks really, really fierce. It's such a statement piece, you know? <laughs> Imagine just walking into the pub like this. That's me all over. <laughs> I do hate strapless bras, I'm not gonna lie, but it's worth it for this. And also because of all the volume that you've got here, this is good for my small chested girls like myself because you don't necessarily have to wear a bra underneath. I can see myself wearing this quite a bit actually. <laughs> I don't know where, but I'll find a way. Okay, I am actually gonna keep this, so I'm gonna cut all the tags off and stuff and just show you what it looks like from the back, guys. Okay, hold on. So yeah, I don't know how you're gonna put this in the wash. As you can see from the back, it's really <coughs> elegant looking. And then you get to the front and it's just absolute madness. This was one of those items that I literally just bought for the haul. I thought to myself, this is gonna be trash. I'm gonna send it back. <laughs> but out of all of the items so far, I think I'm actually really Really, I'm not gonna be able to let go of this. <laughs> and I also kind of wanna keep it on for a while. I know we've gotta get through some items, but I suppose whilst I'm in this, I may as well talk to you guys about the delivery situation, cause that's also quite important. So come in. Oh, tea. <laughs> So one of the other reasons why I wanted to try and like Misguided is because I've paid for their unicorn delivery. <laughs> if you live in the UK, listen up right now because this is an opportunity to save some money. It's $3.99 for normal delivery in the UK. They had an offer on for this thing called unicorn delivery, which is next day delivery for an entire year for $5.99. So if you do your calculations, you're already saving money even if you make just two orders in one year and I have actually ordered another package for next week's haul so yeah it's all just trying to save money really. <laughs> anyway the next item. I honestly feel like a princess in this it's so cute. I am actually gonna lose my shit with the lighting situation right now. It's driving me crazy. <sighs> Apologies guys. Okay what else have we got? Ooh, no. Okay, this one I don't really think you can go wrong with. Lucky for them. You can never have enough black tops. This one looks pretty cute. The light. Why is the lighting changing again? <laughs> Just a quick thing, guys. I don't know why, but all of these items seem to have a very strange scent about them. And they all smell different. I don't know why that is, but I just thought I'd let you know. Thank you. Wow. 
I'm telling you now guys, I am gonna cry when I'm editing this because the lighting is just, it's driving me mad. Anyway, I like this. Even though it's a little bit stinky, it's pretty cute. It makes me feel a little bit hench, but not in a bad way. It kind of looks like a muscle top. It's giving me super confidence. This is just a perfect stable, stable? Wardrobe staple. <laughs> Excuse my camel toe. <laughs> Ow. Oh, I've just pinched myself. Anyway, so in case you can't see in the camera, this is ribbed. It's thick enough, but it's not too thick because if a top's too thick, it's just gonna kind of add bulk. You can easily make it more cropped if you want to, but it doesn't need to be. By the way, a lot of these items are so cheap. I really need a wee. The ribbed skirt is nine pounds. The white top earlier that was trash, that was three pounds 60. And you can see why. This top was six pound 40. Not bad considering that I'm probably gonna be wearing it all of the time. Hold on, let me just take my heels off. Wow, I'm so much shorter. <laughs> okay, and the feather top was 13 pound 60. Again, not really that bad considering it's a complete statement piece. But we've still got more to get through, so. But first I really, really, really need a wee. Okay, I'm back with different lighting. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> okay, this might just look like a little piece of string to you. It is in fact a top and it was three pound. So if this isn't complete trash, I'm probably gonna keep it. I don't tend to get things with patterns on or colors because I'm scared of it, but this was a really cute kind of zebra print. So, or is it a tiger? I don't know. I don't like it. I don't know. This is one of those days, guys, where everything's looking amazing in the mirror, not so much in the viewfinder. <clears throat> I, um, I don't know, it's, <laughs> it's three pounds. Like, do I keep it just because it's three pounds? Am I actually gonna wear it? Can I make this look good? Does it look good? I don't know, because I can't tell. <laughs> Right. Comment down below if you think I should keep this. Um, I've got to make a decision. Right, let's just ignore my personal opinion about it. Let's look at the quality. Okay, so first thing is it's see-through, which is great, <laughs> really useful. That being said, you can wear a nude bra with this and I'm pretty sure it would cover up because the zebra print <laughs> slash tiger is gonna kind of add texture and color up most of what's underneath, except for a black bra. I mean, you are gonna see obviously you can see my strap so the back is just what you see it's also see-through the material is mesh so it'll be nice and cool in the summer I suppose that's a plus and yeah and that's all I have to say about this item okay right <laughs> now we are on to the final item <laughs> Is it the final item? Yeah. Okay, so. Okay, I've been smelling these items every single time I open them. Every single item has a different smell. And this one really, really, really doesn't smell good. What the fuck? Okay, so this top is supposed to be like a acid wash charcoal. Um, I can't tell whether it's supposed to look like this or it's, no. Okay, right. This is the back, take a good look. And this <laughs> is the front. Correct me if I'm wrong, but does that look like does that look like someone's worn it? Like, not just worn it, but like, it, 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 I don't know. It looks like someone's put it at the bottom of their wardrobe. They've like trod food in it and, oh. That's absolutely disgusting. What is that smell? I'm um, okay, I'm, <laughs> I'm a bit scared to touch it now. Cause I, I, I don't know, I, I don't know where this has been. I don't know why they've given me an item that's supposed to be clean. <laughs> but 
for starters. Um, <clears throat> I'm gonna call my dad, hold on. Dad? What's the matter? Okay, so this has come from Misguided, right? Okay. Turn this slide, play. It's got marks all over it. Yeah. I, I didn't know whether it was the print or, or, or whether it's deliberate or it, it just right. smell it, okay. honestly. Okay. No, take that away. That is disgusting. <laughs> I don't know how you can hold it near. Yeah. <laughs> well, your sense of smells better than mine, so that's well, why. Uh, that, that is disgusting. Put it back in the wrapper. Wash your hands. Wait, do, what, what do you, th it, what it do you think like it is? It smells like somebody's been sick on it. Oh, you're joking. No, that's, that smells like somebody's been sick on it. Ew. Wash your hands. Okay. I am so confused right now i have washed my hands by the way <laughs> um i'm a little bit freaked out my dad has a really good sense of smell mine's pretty good but when i smelt it i was like okay that's a really foul smell but i don't know what it could be but now that he said it it smells and looks like someone's been sick on it i don't know it, it seems like it 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 does I can't believe I'm touching it again. I, I just, I, I feel. <laughs> now, if you look up here at the bottom, I don't know whether it might be better if I turn the ring light down. You can't tell me that that doesn't look worn. What's happened to the ring light? Oh. <laughs> Ew, I don't want it on my mic. Ew. <clears throat> uh, why do I keep doing this? <laughs> I just keep smelling it to try and like reevaluate. like does it smell like sick and it actually smells like sick. I don't know how this has happened. I'm gonna put it back in the packet and then we're gonna talk about this, right? Conspiracy. <laughs> Okay, I've done a bit of investigating. Visibly, someone sellotaped that there and there. Can you see the sellotape? This to me is proof that someone has worn this and done something. <laughs> Ew. I really wasn't expecting this. I'm just gonna wash my hands again. <laughs> Yeah, that to me is completely unsellable. You best believe that I'm gonna be messaging them. I, d I don't want to be angry at them. I kind of feel sorry for them at this stage. I feel like evidently this is because of a customer, some girl using this, potentially being sick on it and then sending it back. I don't know, maybe in the warehouse, they've just shipped it out again to someone else, AKA me. All I can say is uh, watch this space. Anyway, I think I've gone on about it enough. Next week's gonna be another misguided haul, so we'll see how that goes. <laughs> anyway, if you guys like this video, be sure to like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell. <laughs> Love you, bye!